Welcome to session seven. This is about chapter 10, which is the seventh C, uh, close. It is important for you to manage the exit carefully and not just assume that it will be okay. Uh, your next consulting job depends on the perception you leave during the close stage. Uh, first, you need to look back and learn. Encourage your client to consider what has been learned over and above the planned outcomes of change. So as part of this step, you ask some questions, and these questions are actually our discussion form questions for this week. So here's the questions. What did we expect to happen? What actually happened? What was the outcome? What worked and what did not work? What have we learned? And what should we take forward to use next time? So the next step is to let look to let go. The onus is on you to ensure that at the point of departure all unnecessary levels of dependence ha have gone from all sides of the relationship. The, que the key question is can they fly solo? Next look at the value. It is important to understand how the outcomes from the change can have tangibly delivered improvement to the operation or commercial viability of the organization. So there are two aspects to the value management process. Number one is value management. Identify the area of the business value improvement that has been managed. And the second is value differentiation counteracting the impact of value shift in the mind of the client and the customer. The next step is to look forward on the assumption that the consultancy assignment has been handled professionally and has delivered the appropriate outcomes, then it may be appropriate to investigate what opportunities might exist for further work. The best time to make a sale is the point when the customer voluntarily says how great the previous product or service has been. Um, the build process is built around three factors. First is build dimensions, second build steps, and third build drivers. The final piece is time to say goodbye. With all great relationships, letting go can be hard. But if we don't, then we become responsible for the creation of a dependent relationship which can give short-term gain but will generally lead to longer-term problems. So this has been a summary of Chapter 10, Stage 7, Close. This week you should turn in your draft final report. This is an opportunity for you to demonstrate in writing the value your consulting has brought to the organization and this is really part of the close process. Um, our discussion forum this week gives you an opportunity to reflect on what you have learned from your consulting practicum.